Hi everybody, welcome to the Plugin Blog. My name is Clinton. We have a really interesting keyboard for you today. It's called the One Lite. It's a smaller version of another keyboard called the One. It's part of a generation of pianos that, that they're calling the Smart Piano, meaning that you have a chance to hook up your iPad or your iPhone or other Android device to your piano. And with the application that you can download for free, you can learn to play music. Believe it or not, it works. We're going to take a closer look at the keyboard, a little bit about the technology behind it, and see if we can't learn a small piece of music. Here it is, the one light. First thing I notice is how simple the front panel is. We're used to seeing uh, many more buttons on a digital piano. But if you look right here, there are only four with a power, sustain, tone button, as well as a volume button. That says to me that we're going to do a lot of our uh, button pushing, if you will, through the apps uh, on our iPad or tablet. Over here, uh, all the cables you'll need. On top, you have a power adapter, followed by your iPhone 4 adapter, followed by a regular, I guess, a Samsung or something tablet adapter, and uh, on the bottom, uh, the Apple Lightning cable, all which connect into the USB port on the rear of the piano, which I'll show you later. Of course, you have the user guide. Next step for me is to take a look at this user guide, get myself friendly with how uh, the system works, and I'll come back to you to show you more. So with this piano, you have a very basic piano. It's 61 keys. They're not weighted, so it doesn't feel much like an acoustic piano. But each key has an LED light behind it, which in conjunction with the iPad will light up and teach you which notes you have to play in the song that you're going to learn. Once you have the iPad or other mobile device attached using the provided cables, you can choose from four categories uh, inside the app that will help you learn the music. One's called Music Lab, there's another called LED Lights, Videos, and games. Of course, you have your own personal profile that you can create through the app that will follow you as you learn the songs. There are traditional and what we consider newer ways of learning as well from sheet music, which is synchronized with the lights on the piano that will follow you as you play, to the more um, current ideas, uh, which are similar to the video game Guitar Hero, if you're familiar. It's very, very interesting, I have to say. I can read traditional music. What I can't do is the newer version. So I decided I would try to see if I could teach myself a piano song using the newer idea, the, what they call the waterfall technique. And I thought I'd see how long it took. I was surprised. I learned to play the beginning section of the Moonlight Sonata by Beethoven in around 30 minutes. And if I may say so, it's pretty good. I think I scored 96 or 98. So it seems to me there's something that's working in this, which is really cool. I'm going to just do a quick demonstration of how it works so you can see. First, it teaches me the keys I have to play. And the keys are lighting up the whole time that I'm doing this. later, I was doing this. So in around 30 minutes, I taught myself that first part of the Moonlight Sonata, and I think the score I received was 95%, I believe, so not bad, a passing grade, right? <laughs> uh, it doesn't replace a real teacher, that's the one thing that worries me the most, is the system doesn't replace a real teacher who will be looking over your shoulder and making sure that you're doing your thing correctly. You have to be very diligent and take care of yourself when you learn these things, but I have to say it's really enjoyable. For, for this nice simple keyboard, you actually get a lot of punch in the 
in the attached uh, tablet, iPhone, iPad, Android device. There's a few other features that we'll talk about that just kind of make the one light that much more fun. So let's take a quick look. When we're talking about the features, I'd like to just mention a couple of things you see on the back that are not usual. You have the USB port, which is actually for connecting your iPad. You also have a mic in and with an auxiliary in and an auxiliary out. That means you can plug a microphone in with a quarter inch cable so you can sing along at home, which is really fun. Also, you can plug in an MP3 or something so uh, you can play along with some of your favorite songs. Uh, and then the output, auxiliary out, would mean that you can send it to some bigger speakers somewhere so you can actually use it for an intimate performance setting. Of course, you can attach a sustain pedal like a traditional piano as well. And there's one more thing I want to take a quick look at with you. The final thing I want to mention is that there are 20 sounds on the one. Right here, there's a tone button, and as you touch it, you get some different sounds to choose from. About those sounds that we just heard, I have to say they're not the greatest sounds I've ever heard on the piano, but you do have 20 different ideas to choose from. So you can have some fun playing uh, some interesting stuff, uh, organs and pianos and harpsichords and there's a violin and there's some drum set in there if you like that kind of thing. Um, but I think these are the things that a company like The One will improve as their new idea and product uh, becomes popular. In conclusion, I just want to say that The One has a very interesting system that's going to help you and your family learn to play piano. It does not replace the piano teacher, but it does do a great deal to, to show you the basics, to get you started, and then perhaps enjoying music around the home. Um, I do find it's quite affordable for, for what you're getting. The quality of the piano sounds and the quality of the keyboard itself, I think, could be better, but I think the reason they're not is that they're putting their emphasis on the, on the, uh, the value-added portion with the iPad and tablet being connected and showing you the way. And, I'm sure that anybody who's been playing for a while will want to graduate to something a little more solid and more, more serious as an instrument. But to get you started, I think it's a great place. You can find it at Best Buy. Uh, so it'll be available online. If it's not now, it'll be very soon. And um, I'm very curious to see how this product is going to change the way things work in music education. Thanks for hanging out with me for a few minutes here. I hope, uh, hope you got some information that's useful for you, and we'll see you next time. Have a good night.